How's it going, guys? Steve here. Uh, just wanted to make a quick review on what's left of this stick. I wanted to get a little farther into it so I could give you, instead of just a first half inch or first inch review, give you with basically a third of the stick left. Uh, having a, a JR, I don't know if that'll focus, but anyway, JR and Limit Ultimate, uh, so, uh, special selection, uh, of course this is a cedar sleeve that was on it, uh, I don't know why that's not focusing, but it's not, probably dirty, uh, anyway, <coughs> uh, sent to me by the one and only Mr. WizD. First off, thank you, brother. This one's the bomb. This is out of his, uh, if I'm not mistaken, this is out of the medium selection that he sent me. Uh, medium, some medium to full. Um, I don't know, remember if he said there was any full in there or not, but uh, probably not. Uh, that, whatever. Uh, I know this one is. Uh, and this is where, if you... I'm on Instagram, so if you see my Instagram post, this is where I started. Mm -hmm. I got it out of the package, and I noticed this one. I'm like, well, that's okay. I can live with that. Got my punch done. About halfway through the punch, I went. It didn't. It didn't split when I punched it. I didn't notice the split till after I punched it and my punch just finished it it let it open up so I don't know what to do with this throw it in the fireplace can't smoke it unless I get a cutter which I don't have and cut it off maybe then I could smoke it but I don't know uh, I know you can burn these down for pipe mud but I think it takes a lot of them, and I'm not wasting a bunch of cigars. But fortunately for me, I have some smaller ones of these that WizD sent me. So, um, getting to this. About let it go out. My wife just recently got me a new lighter. Another Bugatti. That is really awesome. Lights up really nicely. Hmm. That went in my eye. Ooh. Anyway, um, this is JR uh, Ultimate. Very nice cigar. Uh, I enjoy it a lot. Uh, way more than I thought it would. I was actually kind of intimidated by the. Maduro wrapper. I'm going to say it's been a while since I paid attention to it and I'm not very well versed. But um, I was kind of intimidated by that. Oh, and I'm sure there are some that have a darker wrapper that knock you on your butt. This one, very, very, very smooth. Um, and if this is a medium, it's milder than some of the milds I've had. Um, and maybe this is a mild. I don't know. I don't know nothing about the filler. I don't know. I have not looked it up. This is just a, I guess, a blank review. <laughs> um, it's very, uh, very tasty. Very tasty. Uh, nutty. Very slight, uh, like a dark chocolate sweetness to it. Uh, where you get that bitter sweet, no bitter taste, very creamy, uh, extremely creamy smoke, almost uh, vanilla like, and just really sweet. Um, I'm not sure what these cedar uh, wrappers um, impart to the cigar. I know that's it, it helps them, it's supposed to do something. Um, you aficionados can tell me, but. Uh, I got a, I got some 
pretty good bit of nuttiness, which I really, really uh, enjoy. Um, and got that leather, a um, little bit of leather mixed with the nuttiness and that sweetness. Um, and then the creamy. Uh, it's just been a, a, a beautiful smoke. I uh, really enjoyed this, and uh, so thanks, Wizdy, for that. I uh, want to give a shout out to Jeremy Larson, uh, brother. He makes some awesome videos. Uh, been trying to catch up on a lot of videos lately. I've been out of the game, haven't watched a lot except for the last couple weeks. I've been really trying to catch up, or just basically just jump in where I'm at and move forward. Um, so thanks, you guys. Uh, for hanging in there and uh, um, you know thanks Wizdy for this this is awesome uh, wife's playing with the lighter we're gonna burn the house down now uh, just don't burn yourself <laughs> I don't care who bought it <laughs> don't burn yourself but uh, been really getting back into the pipe smoking lately I hardly had a pipe all summer probably not even a half dozen pipes all summer you know right what the heck are you thinking right busy. huh busy. yeah been kind of busy um, but we all get busy we all know that um, you know kind of got out of the scene while you know the whole time I was out of the scene pretty much I wasn't having a pipe really been trying to smoke pipes lately uh, you know, I've had one every night this week, and uh, tonight, my wife said, uh, I don't, what I don't understand, I, and I don't understand how it works, but my wife gets relaxed down by the smell of a pipe, and uh, she wanted to watch a movie tonight, so she said, don't smoke a pipe, <laughs> so she doesn't get put to sleep. Uh, it just relaxes her, and it relaxes me, and uh, so I haven't stick tonight, so, uh, obviously, but uh, I hope you guys uh, are... Uh, you, I hope you had a good week. I hope you have a, a good weekend. Um, it's raining here in South Dakota. Uh, it's part of that hurricane. That means all the way up here, the, the, the feeder bands and the, the rain. I mean, it goes all the way up to here. And um, and we're we're enjoying it a lot. It's been kind of cold today. Uh, I don't think it got much over 50. If it was like 52. I think it was the warmest I've seen it got today. Um, so, hence the hoodie. Uh, I know some of you folks are still warm and t-shirting it, uh, but it was kind of cool today. And so, uh, working on the manliness. Uh, I'm going to try to let this thing, last year I didn't let it get any longer than this, right here. And I started this way after I, you know, I always have this, but I started this, so this is, you know, it's working on it. But I'm going to try to get down to about right in here. Or so and uh, the wife wants to wants me to try that I don't know maybe so she can, can't snatch me around by my hair maybe she can do that I don't know <laughs> so but anyway guys I appreciate you watching and uh, hope you have a great weekend and uh, we'll try to see you pretty soon all right take her easy <laughs>